Hello everybody man, <clears throat> this is RisuXO here and welcome for another video of uh, the Xbox 360 dashboard in 2021 man. And this time we're going to be using the and uh, the not NXT, I mean the the Kinect dashboard from 2010. I'm going to show you how to add it, you know what I'm saying? So so you could you click in the dash shortcut. I have to create a shortcut for that. Um, when you get seen the canaries, you create a shortcut and name it dash. You know what I'm saying? From there you create our shortcut. From there you'll get a folder named dash where you get the dashboards and shit. No dashboards. Now you'll get this and then from there you get dashboards. You can choose which one blades connect and see for some reason blades does not work. I don't know why. The connect and then and see does work. From there you go to um I'm gonna use connect this one. I'm gonna go connect. Choose flash dash um XCX. <laughs> Not like that. And you drag in there. Boom, done. This is the connect dashboard, man. No nostalgia, man. No nostalgia. I remember this shit too. For now, I'm getting block up to one and using this dashboard. I need to go full screen, window, go full screen like that. Done. You're in the Xbox 360 connect dashboard, man. A trip back to 2010, man. 10 years ago, man. 2011. Yeah, 2010, 2011. Because um, late 2011, they changed to the Metro dashboard. Which I don't really like that one, to be honest. I mean, it's not bad. But it's not my preference. But then, this is back in 10 years ago, man. Exactly 10 years ago. Woo! So, yeah. Anyways, welcome page. You know, getting started. Get quick tips about your Xbox 360. Connect for Xbox 360. Experience the magic of Connect. You, you the magic man. Back when Connect was big, you know what I'm saying? Everyone's gonna have a connect with the Wii and everything. Good times, man. Good times. Family first, have fun with the whole family. Hi, Shannon, you can have this shit. So, if you could click this shit on, um, you go back to this page where you know, press the Xbox Guy button to get to almost everything on your Xbox 360. The Xbox Guy is the fastest way to get in and out of games and videos. Talk to friends, tweak your profile, download content, and do just about anything else. So, go ahead, press the phone. Of course, doesn't work on uh, doesn't work on uh, emulator. But there's an option right there. Uh, your profile contains your gamer tag, avatar, achievements, play games, and more. Your achievements and gaming history are also saved on Xbox Live. You can, you can also edit and edit profiles, privacy, and friend settings. Good times, man. Back when the Slim came out. Yeah, this one came out back when the Xbox 360 Slim came out with the Kinect. Corazon, this is protect your family from inappropriate content and online interactions using a robust family settings. Control access to games, movies, and TV shows by reading. Set passcode for family settings access. Limited family daily or weekly plan time. Regular online gameplay and communications. There was more. Go to my Xbox family settings. Shit. Yeah, something is gonna make it crash, so you crash. Go back to this. Just close this out. Open again. Drag this back in. And you're back in right there. So you should be careful because something is gonna crash. Uh, let go to, back to my Xbox. Woo! Just going, just doing this, man, gives me nostalgia, man. Happy moments, man. And ODST, hey, Black Ops 1, Saint Joe 2. Crazy. Go for open train, nothing happens. This crash is 2. I say, do this thing. Just open it again. Just like that. So, yeah, be careful what you press on um, this one. Sign up for a free account and get a bonus gift. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> okay, it's not frozen. Okay, that's about. Yeah, if this happens, you press okay. Keep using it. So, game micro plays get the latest free trials, demos, and add ons. Man, I remember they used to make man demos and shit, man. That was crazy, huh? I remember seeing all this shit. For some more sport doing good as game, man. You see that shit? Pac Man. Watch movies, TV shows, and live sports. The old, the old Netflix and everything. Yeah. 
community, connect with your friends and get inside Xbox. Avatar Marketplace, get clothes, props, and pets for your avatar. Listen to streaming music in your living room. Damn. I remember there was a tutorial, like a little movie tutorial I used to watch it every fucking time. I had to repeat it. When you update it to this dashboard, there'll be a tutorial. I remember that shit. I'll show you how to connect stuff and everything, I remember. So yeah, man, this is the Xbox 360. Connect dashboard. Game, game library. I remember you seeing all this game, you don't have any games in your library, I know that. It's crazy how a fucking mouse can do all this shit, man. Wine Company is the best one, man. You, you, you had to get a PC, man. In the library, of course. You press there, you go back to the welcome page. Yeah, just watch you there right now. Music library, you go back to the welcome page. Picture library, you go back to the welcome page. Of course, I press there, so we're free, so. Windows Media Player was still there. So it's nothing will happen if I press this, so. So it crashed. Shit. Yeah, the, uh, it's cool to just revisit the dashboard. It's good to revisit, but of course you cannot do every, the, exactly everything you should do in Xbox 360. It will freeze on. Yeah, man. I'm not sure what this is. I feel this is some bullshit. Of course, parent settings. Hey, little kids used to be getting trolled by, by YouTubers playing BO2. <laughs> That's how I got created, man. They need parents and no bullshit controls. Yeah, man. This is a Kinect dashboard in 2021, man. Like senior emulator. It was nice to visit back 10 years ago using the Xbox 360. I love the gym. I prefer the uh, NXT dashboard over this one, but this one's pretty good too. Man. I prefer this one over the of the Metro one for sure, for sure. And to be honest, I never experienced the Blaze dashboard, the original 2005 one. I never experienced that one. I got my 360 guy in 2009, so yeah. And 2005 I had the OG Xbox. Well, I got the OG Xbox in 06. Yeah, this uh, it's console safety, system settings, memory. Cool, nothing works, everything will freeze. So, yeah, man, thanks for watching, man. Subscribe for more. And I'll see you on the next time, man. We're still excited, man. Nice experience that connect dashboard in 2020. Experience back 10 years ago. 10 year anniversary, man. <laughs> Anyways.